and welcome back to Yog Sims. Last week we had a look at the Dream Stream House. You all agreed on the whole singing career for Sparkles. Uh, Martin as a stylist seems to have gone quite well. But what was slightly worrying was when I said, what would you like me to do with Strippin's girlfriend? Should I get rid of her? About 90% of you read that as, should I kill her off in some tragic accident? I actually just meant, shall I evict her? Slightly scary how many of you described in detail how to kill her in an interesting way. So I'm a little bit undecided about what to do about that. I, I'll give you another chance. We'll leave her in there for now because she is bringing in some money. She's working at a day spa. She's the only one out of all of them that actually had a job before I went in the house. So we'll, we'll leave her there to make some money. But, you know, you've got another chance to say, what would you like me to do with this, this woman? I thought she was a fairy. Someone actually corrected me in the comments. She's a witch. Fairy has wings. For some reason, I was thinking because she's got a magic wand. She's a fairy. She's not. She's a witch. A load of people said hi to T. Well done. If you do see T, please do say hi in the comments. He loves it. He loves the attention. So just keep waving and keep saying hello to that horse. And he'll be a very happy horse. You've also got to start thinking, guys. After this episode, we've seen everyone's house. Where are we going to go back to? And what do you want me to do? We can follow up with any of the other houses. So let me know in the comments what house, what you want me to do. You know, I can visit loads of houses. I can, like, top up each house with various things each episode, if that's what you want me to do, or I can concentrate on individual houses. What I was thinking of doing was, after this episode, I was thinking of going back to the main Yogscast house, doing a bit of stuff there, and maybe going around in rotation in the order that we went around before, because then everyone kind of knows the system. I don't know. Again, let me know what you think. So we're going to go to the last... the last of the houses today. If you don't know Nalzi, Yogscast Nalzi and Yogscast Panda, and uh, Silas, Prince of Holland, and the assorted pets that they own, now's a good time to meet them. So, Panda and Nalzi's house, here we go. Oh, are you kidding me? Hold the fort. Pause. Pause. Nalzi, what the fuck is this? Why are you a stylist? You, your wish, your goal in life is to become a creature robot crossbreeder. That's like science related. Why the sod are you now a fashion fledgling? I mean, really. I mean, what is this shit? Stay up past bedtime. How fucking old are you? Jesus Christ, dude. Finish a book. Buy a planter bowl. Style an elder. Stop. You know what? Join science career. That's more bloody like it. Let's get rid of this stylist bullshit. Flipping egg. Oh, Panda's a celebrity. He's also an ark builder and he'd like to have lots of pets. He needs two cats, two dogs, two horses, two birds, two lizards, two turtles, two rodents, two snakes, two butterflies and two beetles. Well, he's on the way there already. I'll show you his pets in a minute. He wants a motorcycle. He wants to be a friend with Marmite and with Rufus. These are his pets. I will introduce you to them later. But he is a collector of animals. He, have you got a job? Please tell me you haven't got a job. You've got a car, but I've got him in the wrong place. You're unemployed. Fantastic. <laughs> Fantastic. Niles is also a... What the fuck is going... Why are you both celebrities? Oh, this is getting to their heads. It's this YouTube fame. It's just getting to their heads. They're all becoming celebrities. I did it first, though. Remember that. Oh, really? 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 How high up the chain are you? This is... your stylist level eight. Oh, balls. Oh, God, guys, what do I do? He's the same level as Zoe. Do I do I keep him for the income or do I move him into science? I can move him into science. We could do that next week or whenever. Just let me know. Slight issue. Wasn't expecting him again. Why is everyone going for style? Is it just easy to, to do? I mean, what, what, what do you need to be a stylist? Just, I mean, he's got long, we know he's got long, luscious hair, but, I mean, that's about it. Silas. Now, Silas, his lifetime wish is to be an alchemy artisan. So he wants to reach level 10 alchemy and use 50 alchemy elixirs. So he wants to learn various things. Where, where actually are you, Silas? So let's start, let's start with Silas because he's over here. The bloody angle of the Sims is just spazzing the heck out again. I've, I've spazzed the heck out now. Right. Where are you? Silas, Silas, why are you there? Why are you standing at a concession stand? That's not your job. 
don't know what you're doing. Let's just scroll in so everyone can see what you look like. So this is Xylus. I've had to take some liberties. His hair does not look like that in real life at all. I don't know why it's slightly floofier. Maybe we've just caught him at a bad angle. <laughs> there is nothing funny about school buses. I don't know what you're doing. Why are you here? Why are you here? Like, there's nothing here. I can't interact with it. It's spazzing out. You're going to make a snow cone. Okay, fine. Do what you want, love. Strange little man. Panda! Let's pause for a second. You want to be friends with Lyndon as well? That, that's fine by me. Panda! Let's go say hello to Panda. Whee! Ooh. Now, he does look a little bit special, I'm afraid. I'm not sure why it's turned out like that. Um, maybe it's the eyes. I think the eyes might be slightly big in his face. He doesn't look like that at all. I, you could tell I made this house last, can't you? Because I was just, by then, I was just like, I can't make everyone look correct. It's just not working. So he's making noms, which is fine. Oh, oh, Silas just met Rithian. Never okay. Oh, oh, Link, oh, uh, no. So this is Nalsi with his slicked back style hair. This is Marmite. Oh, no, that's a wall. This is Marmite, everyone. No, no, Marmite, no. Reinforcement, gold, praise for being a piggy, sure. She needs, he needs feeding up. I think Marmite's a he. There he is, oh, he's a lovely little cat. Yes, yes. <gasps> little cat, you can be best friends with Marmite if you want. I don't think Panda will be happy about that. You have got your own cat. Here's Rufus. Mm -hmm. There's your Rufus. Oh, look at the doggy. Look at him. Isn't he lovely? Oh, God, we don't have any pet bowls. We don't have any pet bowls. Oh, God, I've forgotten all this kind of stuff. Oh, Christ. The pets are going to starve. And I've gone the wrong way on the tilt. I always do this. Oh, God. Um, It's also spazzing out slightly because it's still loading, I think. Do we have another... F no. Okay, that's fine. No snooze alarm clock. Oh, yeah, it's the best alarm clock in the world. Apparently, I can't put it down. Facing the right way. Don't fuck with me, alarm clock. I know your game. Put that one there. Look, I just want to turn it around so it looks normal. I mean, what's the problem? Come on. I, I can't stand the, t the old TV. The Sims get really grumpy about it as well. So, would you like a new TV? New TV? Oh my god, not for that price! Holy fucking shit! I have that bastard thing back. I have that one. There we go. Uh, that's actually not bad. I'm reasonably happy with that. They've got all the amenities, haven't they? I think. We, oh god, pet stuff. We still haven't got pet stuff. I'm, I'm getting distracted again. What can we fit in there? Oh shit, son. <gasps> da 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 da! And then if we move this in here, like so. Oh my God, I'm a genius. I'm a fucking genius. Yeah, there we go. And then the cat bed can go there. Dog bed can go there. Oh yeah. Oh fucking yeah. I think that works. I think that works. I think everyone's got somewhere to live and sleep and, and things. We don't need a horse. No one needs a sodding horse at this point. We've got too many horses with too many big personalities. I'm looking at you, T. Okay, so we've got, we've spent too much money on the cats and the dog, but you know, it's important. The smoke alarm is in really in the wrong place. It should be like, oh, oh, I see. Uh, it should be there, I think. That's probably a little bit better to be actually near the oven. Uh, we do need a, Oh shit, uh, what can I sell? What can I sell? What can I sell? What can I sell? No one needs this potted plant. Who the sod has a potted plant? No one ever uses them. There we go. Good job. Whew. Right, now where were we? <coughs> Calm down everyone. Bloody hell, it's quite loud. So here we are. Panda's making something nommy. Rufus is very interest interested. Uh, you're having f oh, you ha oh, look at him, he's playing with the laser pointer. Oh, look. Who the fuck are you? Leave my house. Oh, it's paparazzi. 
Now, see, can you can you tell him to? Oh, just leave him. Actually, what is he doing? Just don't cast magic on my cat, and I'll be all right. You're blocking the view. Excuse me, Mr. Paparazzi. You're. Oh. Can you just leave, please? Panda, stop whinging and learn to cook. Be begged. Okay, you can be begged. She's ruthless, you going over here. To be fair, I'm not sure you should be encouraging them by... Oh, it's because they're hungry. Oh, hello, little Rufus. Hello. Hello, you good boy. Oh, there we go. Nancy's doing it. Who's a good doggy? Who's a good doggy? Who's a good doggy? Scuba these. Look at me, you good doggy. If they fit so dry. So we've got a snoozy little marmite over here. He's a snoozy snooze. Little snoozy kitty. It doesn't do uh, pets very well, but that's pretty good. Oh, don't shout. Well, that's pretty much true to life. We are not buying a rocking chair, Nalsi. Just deal with it. Oh, yeah, shit. We need to, we need to, oh, God, what do we need to do? Do we need to fire him? I think we do. What the sod is this? What is this? Nalzi, what is this? Where have you picked this sodding thing up from? What is this? Oh my lord. <laughs> That's terrifying. Yay, Panda got a thing. Well, can you tell him to piss off? Attack him. Attack him, Lyndon. Go on. Get him. Drive him off the porch. Go on. Do it. Go on, Rufus. Get rid of him. Lyndon, you're a terrible guard cat. Go away. Just get rid of him. Get. Oi, get rid of him. Go on. There we go. Who's a good kitty? Go on, piss off. Um, Rufus, you're on the bed. That's not allowed. Oh, he's made friends with him again. Oh, balls. Oh, well. Ah. Do, 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 do. Oh, dear. I don't think... I don't think uh, Lyndon likes your playing, Nancy. Uh, yowl along. Oh, this is fucking brilliant. Hang on. Look at this. Oh, that's amazing. This is hilarious. What the fuck am I doing? Oh, he's got a hot dog. Look at him. Oh, he's got a little hot dog. You got a little hot dog? You eat your hot dog? What the sod's going on, Silas? I heard a noise. So you're going to teach him a trick? You're going to teach Rufus to sit? Should we try and see if you're any good with the uh, dogs? I'm not sure he is, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, everything's very funny, mate. Can you just teach him how to sit? Uh, Rufus, what are you doing? You don't walk backwards. It's not what normal people do, or dogs, but OK. Sit your, sit your punk ass down. Go on. <gasps> there he is, isn't he a lovely doggy? Swig? Ruby? I partly want to do this just because I want to see Silas teach him how to sit, which is just going to result in Silas sitting on the floor. Stwag. 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 Reglum. Uh. Come on, Rufus. Come on, Rufus. Uh. You can do this. Uh. Narpo. Quincy. Quincy. Come on. 
Schnook. Schnook. Oh, look at him. He's looking up at him so patiently. Knuckle. Swibs. Swibs. <laughs> oh, this is, this is brilliant. This is exactly what I imagined Zylus would be like if you tried to teach a dog to do anything. It would just be like, what the fuck are you on about, mate? I'm just going to fast forward to see if he ever fucking gets it. Doggo. Oh, he sat down. <gasps> He's a good dog. He's a good doggy. Oh, there we go. You're going to sit again. You're going to sit. Come on. Oh, Linda's going in the litter tray. Oh, he's a good dog. He's a good doggy. Feed him a treat and then you can go. He's a good doggy. You can stop now. Can you get rid of him? I mean, can we literally tell him to stop doing that and tell him to piss off? Come on, Nalzi. Show some, show some balls and told him to piss off. Lord Barney do. Stupid paparazzi. <laughs> oh, don't just clap. No, don't invite him inside. What are you doing? No. Can you ask him to leave? Ask him to leave. Ask him to fucking leave. Complain about sleep. <laughs> ask for fairy enchantment. Sure. Sure. I mean, this is not like a waste of my time. Oh, now we've got stray cats. Maybe that'll insult him and he'll go away. Oh no, no, what are you doing? Oh. What did you just, oh God. What have you done? What have you done? What, what happened? What, are you just glowing like a lunatic? Oh good. Right, okay, it's, right, it's war mate, it's fucking war. How do I get the fucking... Aha! It's war. Move objects on. Oh, you dick. Move. Ob okay, let's try. Move. Okay, fine. Move objects on. No. Ah, there we go. Okay, bitch. Mr. Victor Bean. For crimes against the Nazi panda household and just being a general pain in the ass, being loud and annoying me whilst I'm trying to do a commentary. Goodbye. <sighs> oh, how peaceful is it now? Except for the squeaking of Rufus and the shining of Nazi. I mean, look at that fucking shit. What is this? He's like the bloody, like... Northern Lights. Who's that? Just a random... What is that? Is that a cat? Oh no, it's a bird! Oh, it's a spotted sixum. I don't know, think that's a real bird. Where's the... Oh, is that... Oh god, I'm trying to identify the... Um... Tech It Rebirth House. Is it that one? Oh no, that's, that's what she, Oh no, it is, because there's T's. <gasps> there's T, everybody. You know what to do now you've seen T. Uh, what we do want to do is I want to get Silas into alchemy, which I've never really done before. Uh, uh, careers? Maybe. Actually, that's the point. Nazi, oh God. Oh god, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to do that. It's all rainy. Nancy, I want you to go get plastic surgery. Science lab. Join ghost hunter profession. Oh my god. Guys, guys, we've got to do this. We're doing he's doing ghost hunting. He's doing ghost hunting. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Nancy, but it's you brought it on yourself. You brought it on yourself, mate. Um, Panda wants to catch a snake, which is a bit strange. Can we get him a job with animals? Is there an animal related job that I can find without flailing wildly? There might be. School. No. Stadium. No. Do 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 I know you don't like the outdoors, you just have to suck it up. Oh my god. I'm slightly scared. That is very thundery. Yes. 
Get on it, Nalsi. I want you to be ghost hunting extraordinaire. Yay! Maybe we can even make you like Derek Akora. Oh god, just as long as he doesn't use it on Rithian. What if he uses it on Rithian? Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. What if he does that and then we like... Architectural designer profession? Yeah, sure. What the fuck? These jobs are weird. I'm trying to get Xylus an alchemy thing, but I don't even know if that's a, a viable thing or whether it's just like a part-time fun jobby job. We've only got 41 simoleons as well. I've just suddenly noticed. Um, I'm, You know what? I'm going to get him a mixology class. Okay, yeah, let's do culinary. I, it makes sense to have culinary, doesn't it? If you're... Uh, if you're gonna be in alchemy, you need like cooking. It's like chemical cooking, isn't it? Because you can't, you can't just level it up. So let's do that. That makes sense. Good, good, good. Well, that was bloody stressful. Um, I'm gonna go back to the house if I can find the damn thing. No, don't go home. I just want to zoom in. Christ on a bike. Oh, it's much quieter here. Panda is going to be a fabric fetra. Small child, do not live on my porch. Thank you. I don't appreciate it. Very nice. So, there we go. Oi! No fighting. What's this bullshit? No. Uh, yes, Silas, you can be a culinary scullion. Wow. Silas's boss is Belinda Crumplebottom. Having a good relationship with your boss never hurts. Well, I wonder if Belinda's single. If you know what I mean. We'll have to get you an elixir table, which I can't currently do because you're poor. So, uh... Actually... Oh, now we can! You've all got cars. There's no need for a car in the drive. It's just ridiculous. Like, it did, literally is ridiculous. Uh, alchemy cabinet. No, we need a lab. Do we need a lab? I'm not quite sure how this works. Uh, sort by function. Stage props, pet essentials, vehicles, kids, storage. Plumbing. No, family inventory. Amethyst and the... S okay, well, whatever. We'll keep that in the family inventory. I don't know what that's doing there. Um, cars, kids... Uh, lighting, decor, entertainment. Here we are. So hobbies and skills. And I would like you to... Is this it? Oh my god. Here we are. This is it. Oh my fucking god. That's huge. Uh, I think we'll put it outside as well. Just in case of a fire. Call me, call me strange. Call me paranoid. I'll give them a, a telescope as well. Uh, but I, I don't trust Silas with with that. So here we go. Now you can research your alchemy. This looks very nice. I like this. I like this model. It's very nice. Oh, Christ. Who's this woman? We have so much in common. I'd love to get to know you better, Silas, says Belinda Clump Clumplebottom. Clumplebottom. You're going to research some alchemy. Actually, you're learning that really fucking fast, aren't you? Jeez. I hope the couple... There we go. Hooray! Uh, good. Oh, shit. Uh, your phone, your phone. Silas, your phone. Oh, Christ. Where's your phone? Answer the damn phone. Uh, answer the phone. Quick, quick. Are you going to go to work? That would be good as well. It's not your work hours, but it was. Have I now missed it and I'm getting told off? This is what confuses me, like, a f quite a few times. What is that cat doing? Why are you sleeping there? What the sod is that? Rufus, what is this? What is this, Rufus? What is this? Like, seriously, have you dug up my garden? There'll be hell to pay. You've eaten my fucking grapes. Off the grapevine. 
Oh god, oh what is this? Who's wet themselves? Oh, God. Can you, can we reinforce? No, I'm going to scold you for being, oh, what? I want to, come on, scold for being a piggy and peeing. There'll be no peeing in the house. <laughs> Bad dog. Oh, the case of the missing golden llama is getting ice cold and the local police could sure use your sim's help. Only a psychic can dissect the scene of the crime. You're not a psychic. What? Are you actually going to be Derek Akora? That's hilarious, because he's a massive fucking fake. That's amazing. So whilst, whilst Nazi's doing that, questions for next week, everybody. Should Panda become a crazy interior designer? That was on a whim. I can make him be something else. Silas, should we make him some sort of crazy alchemist man? I mean, you know, he's from Holland, so he must have some sort of genetic makeup for brewing up things somewhere. I don't know. Should I make Lyndon, Rufus, Marmite well behaved? I mean, they're reasonably well behaved, like quite net. They're reasonably well behaved now, but should I teach them a bit more? Are we pleased with Nazi's choice of supernatural paranormal dude? Should he continue along this line or should he get another job in science? Up to you guys. Let me know in the comments and I'll see you next week. In theory, I'm going to go back to the main Yoskest house and see what's going on, see why I'm a celebrity, see what's up with these bloody shorts Duncan's wearing. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you next week for more Yog Sims.